Hi everyone, I'm Nona Diandi here and today I will answer a question from Sean Brown. He asked me if this image can be done in Canva. This is a image from Ponsai. Okay, and uh, let's start making it in Canva. I use Instagram post portrait here. So for the first, I will add the green pier element. Okay, I will reduce the size like this. Okay, and then I will add a square. This square I will change to yellow. Okay, and then I will increase the size and change the corner rounding to zero and then send it to back. If you use the new editor, just go to the bottom and click here to revert it to the old editor. So uh, get to edit image and then choose Duotone. You can find it here. Okay. Just choose Duotone and click one of it. I will click the cherry and click it once again and then change the highlight click the highlight go change to white and then the shadow also change to white and then tap apply okay now we will make a wrinkle so go to element i will use this uh, square change it to white i will reduce the color uh, the size and then i will reduce the corner rounding all right maybe like this and then duplicate and then add a square a circle in white and also reduce the size place it maybe okay and add it here okay and now we will create the first frame we need two frame here so download it SPNG download okay and then add new page in black and then upload the page one here go to edit image and then remove the background the white color i mean okay tap apply increase the size to fit the page and now we will go back to page one and add element of uh, this element the name is abstract water wave Factor illustration design. Change all the color to white. Sorry, I mean change the, all the color to yellow. All right. And then duplicate. okay and then add a square in white to cover it all right and then download it the page one okay now add new page in black and then add the second page one here and then remove the white color tap apply okay now add the 
fear for the first let's make it bigger like this and then do send it to back and then duplicate it and we will crop it okay and then and send it backward so this is between the frame yellow frame and the fear okay now add this element waving black shadow from up this studio okay and then go to edit image and choose adjust and then add the blur at 10 okay now let's make it rotate a little and then duplicate and reduce the size and then duplicate again and let's make it for this okay and then once again all right and then once again now let's duplicate it make it here and then duplicate let's flip it vertical duplicate again reduce a little and rotate it all right okay let's uh enough with this all right and then change the page color to yellow and this is uh, some excess so we have to cover it with the yellow shape okay all right just duplicate and place here duplicate and cover it and then download as png now go to page two okay and then upload the page three here go to edit image and then choose bg remover okay tap apply increase the size to fit the page all right Crop a little now add the men's bailey here fat men's bailey let's use uh, this one edit image and bg remover all right and then click erase we will erase it manually make the brass larger okay now tap done 
and apply. Wait until it become a check mark and then flip it horizontal. Okay. Send it to back. All right, and then okay, select the the pier, and then go to edit image and add shadow. Choose the drop shadow. Click it once again and change the direction to bottom. All right, and then the offset uh, one, and then tap apply. You can add a transparency, sorry, and then apply, and then send it backward, backward. Okay, now add a belt, this belt, and edit image. Sorry for uh, before. This is the before after young man, young man, fat belly, the element of it, and then the belt is belt. Okay, and then remove the background. Type apply. Reduce the size. and then rotate it okay and then send it to back all right and then crop it and uh Now let's add a shadow. Shadow. Let's have this one. Reduce the size. Rotate it. Place it here. And uh, go to position layers and send it uh, behind the belly all right and then duplicate it and send again behind the belly okay and then i think duplicate again for this uh, part Okay, and send it behind the belly. All right, and then uh, add the add the pair again. All right, and send it to back. Okay, and then let's make it darker. Go to adjust and then reduce the brightness. Okay. And now uh, we have to add some shadow here use this drop shadow so let's make it here all right duplicate and now let's use it drop shadow the curve ok 
Okay. Let's uh, remove it. Let's use this one. The name is Drop Shadow by Friends. All right. Let's do something with the bailey. Let's make it darker. Go to edit image and this one and saturation and contrast. The blur, reduce the blur. Okay. Uh, we are in all right this is the number okay and now let's uh, make it back and send it to front okay i think it's enough but how oh, this is one problem go to element and add this okay let's uh, make it just little and place it here to cover the cut and send the frame to front and then add the yellow square Okay, now let's download it. Page 2 only. Now add a new page. In white. and then upload the page to here and go to edit image remove background all right now we got the result okay and then just add the shadow this circle shadow and place here and send it to back and now you have the size and then just let's add the background for example wooden table go to photos can choose whatever you want and let's I will pick this one. Click uh, twice and then increase the size. Tap done. All right, let's make it here. All right, and then you can add another ornament here let's just be creative so this is the tutorial see you next video and have fun with canva